Hi, it's Nastya from Tilda. In this video, I will show you how to create this effect for your Tilda website. First, let's create a card in zero block. You can create one from scratch or import your layout from Figma in seconds. To learn more about Figma import, check out the video tutorial in the description. Select all elements of the card and group them. Choose Object under Group. This way, when we animate the layout, settings will not be applied to each element individually, but to the entire group, as if it were a single element. Now let's make several cards. To do this, select the desired group, copy and paste it using hotkeys, Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Drag the card down and repeat the action. Before adding animation, edit the contents of each card. Select the object group of the first card, go to basic animation settings, and select on window top under fixing. For distance, you need to calculate the sum of heights of two cards. You can use the built-in calculator in the field. The card I created is 550 pixels, so the sum is going to be 1100 pixels. Then, copy animation to clipboard. Select the second card and paste the animation settings you just copied. This time, under distance, enter the height of one card. And for the third card, you don't need to add any animation settings. Let's publish the changes and see how it turned out. Now, when you scroll down, the first card is going to be fixed at 1650 pixels. Then it's going to be overlapped by the next card, which is going to be fixed at 1100 pixels. Finally, the third card will overlap the first two, ending the animation sequence. This animation effect is mobile friendly. To enable it for mobile devices, first, make sure you've adjusted the layout for all screen resolutions, then click Switch On under Mobile Animation in the settings. Adjust the distance according to the height of the card for each resolution, and it's done. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe for more content, and share your thoughts in the comments.